Welcome everybody, I'm Burner and this is The Walking Dead Road to Survival. We're doing roadmap playthroughs. Right now we're making our way through Days Gone By number two. We're working in Act 2 and as you can see we're going into Stage 6. You know, I found out the hard way that um, this is a, a human stage and not a walker stage. Uh, so I changed up the team a little bit. Unfortunately, I'm kind of limited to... Uh, the amount of lower level three stars I have right now so you'll see that I do have three characters that are maxed uh, tier 3 level 50 uh, you know Carl and Glenn are both free characters uh, uh, I with humans at this level you kind of need a healer to uh, you know augment the team because you're going to take damage you're expecting to take damage and a lot of times uh, you know, replenishes won't be enough. So you need to have an AR in there that's healing up. Uh, you know, this Dale, Days Gone By Dale, as it were, is uh, one of the better three-star healers you can get. Uh, it just so happens that I have him. Uh, and then Gloria and Sandy, you know, uh, <clears throat> between the, the three reds that I have here, uh, you know, you kind of just got to get lucky and pull them. But they're, you know, no more rare than any other three-star as uh, far as I'm aware. If we look at weapons, I try to do the same uh, as we did with earlier teams. I only have one three-star, uh, and I have the rest are two-star weapons. Should be easily attainable. And then as we look at the items, you know, bringing smelling salts, you know, do count on somebody probably dying. Uh, some replenishes, and then both the blue and red vials. So we're going to really work our buffs. We're going to try and do it without a, um, a faction ally as usual. And let's go ahead and jump in and see what this team can do. Alright, starting against blues and reds. And let's go ahead and let's do some debuff. Let's buff. And the good thing about stages like this, uh, you know, we have five waves. And with our buffs, we can bring uh, ten items. So that means, you know, we can use two of each. Wow, Sandy is already down. Man, that is just sad. All right, let's see what we can do. Let's go ahead and I'm going to leave her down for now because we don't want to bring her back just to have her killed again. Uh, so we'll see how everybody fares uh, with the rest of these guys. Uh, let's go ahead and use a few replenishes. As usual with any any stage, it uh, is a little harder until you get your, your ARs firing off. And as you can see, you know we're kind of taking some decent damage here. All right, we got Dale. He's ready to pop now. Everybody is attacking him for some reason. I guess we're going to have to use him. And Dale shot off. And as you can see, yeah, it brought most of us back up to 100%. Um, I would have liked to have uh, had Sandy alive for that. But uh, kind of just as we're getting it handed to us, yeah, I didn't want her to just come back just to die. Uh, Gloria's a debuff. And let's see if Carl can do enough damage here. Not really. Alright. Man, they love attacking Dale for some reason. Yeah, let's get it through. Dale's up. Yeah, if we can survive here, let's get Sandy back. We'll get Dale to heal. And ideally, we'll be going into the next stage with all five at good health. Well, that was pretty ugly, guys. i got to be honest. I'm not uh, holding out a lot of faith here for uh, making it through this stage, but hopefully we can make it uh, through this second wave a little bit smoother. Tell you what, I'm going to go ahead and debuff that guy, too. We kind of need all the help we can get after uh, judging from the first wave. And let's get some additional debuff all around and use our matchups. Yep. Uh, one of the things we missed out with Sandy last time is she's area of effect up to three. So that's a little helpful. And I'm noticing Gloria is about to kick the bucket. So let's just plus her up a tiny bit. And get Sandy a little bit of love as well. Alright, we're doing a little bit better. We're keeping people alive. That's what I like to see. You know, Carl's not really going to give us too much advantage here against a red. So I'm just going to save his AR. Sandy is dead again. 
Yeah, you know, I I know she was lower level, so I threw her in here to kind of even things out, but I gotta be honest, she's kind of being one huge liability right now to our team. Um, looks like we're gonna at least make it to wave three. You know, we got two ARs ready to go, so hopefully that'll give us a little boost. It'd be nice to make it through a wave without Sandy dying on us. Uh, you know, if we have any chance of making it through um, this stage, I think we're going to need that to happen. So, hopefully Carl can do a one-hitter, and he cannot. We got Sandy out. You know, I'm going to save Sandy until Gloria fires on this next round and debuffs everybody. If everybody stays alive, good. Let's debuff. And let's get Sandy firing. And let's try and hopefully we'll at least get this one off. Good. Let's get Glenn to boost us. And Gloria's looking a little bit weaker than I want her to. And let's get back into it. Alright. Not even going to play her. Oh, Dale is impaired. Okay. Well, hopefully they won't pick on him. Yeah, we picked on him a little bit, but let's get him going. They still got debuffs on defense. And we're moving through. Okay. Alright. Two more waves. You know, we still got a, a good amount of items. I think it's going to be close. Actually, we should get a pretty good little hand up here. Because uh, we have good matchups uh, with our personas. So I'm going to debuff with Gloria. And I'm going to hit with Sandy. And hopefully Sandy will come through for us. That was not nearly what I was hoping out of Sandy. Uh, especially being red and facing all greens. You know, Carl and uh, Glenn probably have it cut out for them uh, on this round. Just because they're going to hit. I wish Dell would have been ready sooner. Uh, let's go ahead and heal up Glenn as much as we can. I definitely don't want to send him out to the slaughter. All right, perfect. So we can get a little healing. We can get a little, little hurting. All right, looks like we're going to be at least able to make it into wave five here. Good. And time's getting pretty thin on us. Alright guys, let's get to it. We know we got good matchups down there. We have enough items. I'm just going to spread the buff love around. And we're going to try and... Alright, Carl's down. He's not offering us a whole lot of help to anybody. I'm going to hit there. Let's try and get Sandy do some damage I'm looking at my health we're we're doing okay I'm gonna save the smelling salts just in case somebody that we we need a little bit more than Carl gets taken out he does have uh, his AR ready to go so it might be worth bringing him back I did not mean to heal Gloria I kinda lost track of Glenn there and it looks like we're gonna get this though and Sandy firing. Well, there you have it, guys. It was tough, but we managed to squeak our way through. You know, I might have to replace Sandy uh, just because she's so uh, low-leveled here. You know, if we want to keep making progress without using a faction ally. Um, otherwise, you know, I feel like we're making our way with a, you know, a pretty marginal team still. One that everybody can piece together. There you see our stage rewards. Uh, that's it for now, guys. I'll see you over in Stage 7. For now, I'm Burner. Flame out.